Hey everyone, today I wanted to walk you step by step through something that can be a little hard in an image manipulation program, and that is merging two images together. Now as the images get more complex, it becomes a little bit harder to do this because you're taking a piece from one image and a piece from the other and merging them together to look like they're one image. So today I'm going to show you the basics of this to get you ready to use harder images in your projects and merge them together. So today we're going to be merging a tennis ball with a baseball. Now what I've done to this baseball is that I've used a soft eraser, I've erased away this bottom line. And what I wanted to do was to take this tennis ball and look like it's laced into the bottom of this baseball. So how are we gonna do that? First, we need to cut out the part of the tennis ball that is going to look like it's laced in. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have to trace around all of these laces and above this tennis ball to cut out the part that we don't want. So we're gonna be using the path tool for this and I'll be right back and show you the path that I made. So this is the path that I made. It goes above the selection that we wanna cut out. So this is how we're gonna cut out our selection. We're gonna go over to this path that we made. We're gonna right click, click path to selection it highlights it. Then we're going to select the tennis ball layer, go up to edit, cut, and select none. And as you can see, if I toggle this path off, we have some little problems that we can erase with our eraser. And again, I use the soft brush for the eraser because that's the best when merging images so you don't have harsh line that can look really awkward. So we're just gonna erase all this, being very careful by the part that is on the other side of this lace. You can use a smaller brush size. Just kind of erase it so it takes the shape of what this looks like on the other side of the laces. All right, that looks good. It looks like we might have a little bit of a problem down here. I'm going to make my brush smaller. I'm just going to kind of merge this to make it look natural. Okay. So now I'm going to turn the opacity back up on the tennis ball to see what else we need to erase. Now we can see the background of this tennis ball is interfering with this baseball layer. So we need to make sure this tennis ball layer is selected, go up to colors, color to alpha, and select white to get rid of. Now since we erased this little part of this baseball, it looks like there's a really nice clean merge between the baseball and this tennis ball. We can turn down this opacity, but you're going to get an awkward line there, so I'd recommend keeping it up kind of high. That's how you basically merge two images. You take something from one image and something from the other image, and you combine them together to make them look like they're seamlessly together. Now this was a basic tutorial because as you can see, it kind of looks awkward around the tennis ball. This is where shading comes in to make it look like the tennis ball actually is part of the baseball. But that is another video. If you'd like to see that, please let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and learned something today. Thanks for watching.